Did you get all the information, double agent, from the chat room of that decrepit, disgusting D character? Oh, hi. Welcome, everyone, to the Real Movies Cast episode. Great, great. <laughs> I am your host. It's the 800 and Executive Order 66. I am your host, uh, Matrix Lord 2 and 2, and I'm with Scott. What's up, Scott? How hey, are folks. You? My little live indicator is coming right up, so I didn't even know what He's was going on. Uh, so, uh, pay attention. How, how, how are you doing? All right, let's talk about Dr. Who, are we? All right. And we'll, we'll talk about that other stuff off air, Scott. All right. Uh, anyway, so. We got um, yeah, yeah. some okay, information. Okay. We got some information today. I'm going to um, try to screen share it with you. There was a leak today. Connor had showed me the. Um, there was a tweet, and we think it's. Oh, that picture! Yeah, that picture of the get, the person with the gun. Yeah, I just saw. I, yeah, I just saw that. I wasn't sure if that was a cosplay thing someone was doing, or that, or that was general. Yeah, I'm going to try to get the, uh, there we go, okay. Yeah, I'm going to screen share this for you, folks. Let's see. Okay, here we go. Screen share. Here we go. All right, do you see that, Scott? Yeah. Okay, this thing is sick, okay? If they do do oh, the Genesis that, of the oh, Cyberman. Yeah. This is sick. Ooh, that is not, that is awesome. It hasn't that, been confirmed, I'm, but if it is the Cybermen, that is amazing. That, that would make actually a great uh, background. I may, I may have to just steal that and, find, and put that either on my <laughs> uh, phone or on my uh, main computer. Yeah, so I, I would be looking forward to that is just, a new, well, original design, I guess, of the Cyberman, yeah. because maybe that's yeah, not yeah. exactly... From uh, Death Planet. Yeah, so maybe not, not exactly the design. And somebody sent me a message. They had to work their way up to what we call the Tenth Planet anyway, so that's probably like an early rendition of their helmets, and then they just went with the Tenth Planet one. But I would. I mean, I I love. I know what it is. Just that that straight face thing. They eventually turned into. I'm just. I'm not that thrilled with. I like the ones that were in the uh, Doomsday and all the ones that came past. But the ones that came later were just like this sheer. And they need yeah. to go back to the whole goal being uh, their menace thing. I love to see uh, Voga returned. Hey, Gloria. Hello. All right, Gloria. Hello. 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 How are you, Gloria? <laughs> I'm good. You guys? Are, yeah. What's up? How are you guys? We're doing good, actually. Um, we're talking about the... Uh, well, let me just... I don't know if you saw the previous cast, but let me just um, screen share this again. Um, I was busy watching the um, the uh, journey so far, the Walking Dead special, where it uh, talks about all the previous all the episodes so far. Oh, the journey? Yeah, uh, Sharon was... Uh, yeah. I taped it, so... It was pretty cool. You'll, you'll enjoy it when you watch it, when you get around yeah. to watch Okay, so we're doing Real Who Beans, and this picture was leaked. Uh, that might be from Genesis of the Cybermen. Oh, cool. If they are doing it, this might be the original design of the Cybermen, or a new design, I'm not really sure. Cool. But it looks kind of terrifying. Yeah, but cool. <laughs> yeah. I, I, it looks sort of like a gas mask. Type of thing. Yeah, yeah. A little, yeah. That's but, that's what first went into my mind when I saw it. Yeah. Yeah. I was joking. I was joking. Have baser things on when they. What's that, Scott? I said that's probably what they had to base their main helmets on at first, because because uh, if their planet, because if I remember right, their planet had been yeah. jettisoned uh, centuries before, and mm -hmm. they would after a while the air would have to have gotten real toxic. So let's put a gas mask on. Everywhere, and then somebody probably thought, you know, maybe these could work as uh, main, like little trial runs, and then we'll just evolve from there. It's funny how the I again, I don't know if this is on 
if they're different sizes, but it looks that some some men are bigger than others. I'm not really yeah. sure if they're on a lift or something, but I think the brain may be exposed too, or the the helmet thing is not complete. I'm not really sure. I can't see from this picture, but it does look terrifying. And I joked around on the uh, two casts ago, and I said that if you keep staring at it for like a minute, you know how when things blur around you? I said it looks like Davros, but that does, <laughs> that's only if you stare at it too long. But anyway, um, this would be awesome if they really give us the best Cyberman story ever, which I'm really hoping for. So. And, even, and even if it doesn't turn out to be Genesis, the Cyberman, just using these masks and this thing in general would be Maybe it's awesome. a different villain. Maybe it's not the Cyberman. Maybe it's True. Satan. You know, maybe it's, I mean, it looks like Cyberman because it has, like, the mouth. Mm -hmm. It has holes in it. You but know? you don't have the, the ear muffs. Right. But it could be, you know. Uh, An early model. Something else. So, pretty impressive, though, whatever it is. So, I'm excited about that. Uh, again, I'm dying to see what it is. Uh, we, we had a new member that started on our last cast, Paul. So welcome aboard, Paul. He started already. And we were talking about Series 11 because the thing was, it's like, well, when are they going to stop filming Series 10? We know it's going to air in April, but when are they going to start filming Series 11? Because technically they should be filming it next year. Mm -hmm. But being that Moffat, they started late, you know, maybe they're going to start filming in June. Of series 11 but when is it going to be released so that's the problem yeah there's a lot of things to talk about a lot of we're, we're just hoping that the schedule it's not like the later year or like you know split season or whatever i really hope that they're doing it now getting the scripts ready and then they could just film and then hopefully we could have it april even if it doesn't start april maybe may or june if they start <laughs> Yeah, even the 4th of July, it would be kind of smooth. And that yeah. could be a great uh, – if they do start it on the 4th of July, they could do maybe the first or second episode as if the Doctor traveled to the 4th of July. Because they say – as I hate saying it as an Earth adventure, but – You know, a lot of series end in May and June. So for them to start then, not a lot of series start. So people would devote their attention to Doctor mm -hmm. Who, I think. If it started in June, if, they, if it didn't, like in other words, if it didn't start in April for Chibnall, they started in June, people would be like, oh, this is cool to watch. It'll be the whole summer. They get oh, to watch yes. Doctor Who. They'll take a little break and then they go to Christmas special again. Yeah. What do you think, Gloria? And gives enough time to build up to the Christmas episode, too, where when you start later, it's like, uh, okay, we got to rush and get the Christmas episode. I know they filmed that long, long before, but still. What do you think, Gloria? What? About what? Well, I mean, do you think uh, it's they're gonna have, we're gonna have um, series eleven start, you know, two thousand eighteen, or you think they're gonna delay it, or you think? Uh, well, I I don't want them to delay it. I want them to you know have it be as soon after you know uh, series ten as they can get, you know, because I mean we've had such a long wait in between nine and ten. It's like don't do it to us again, please. <laughs> I mean, we know a series ten starts in April. That we know. Mm -hmm. So, and it will finish probably by May or June, I guess, or whatever. Yeah. Um, but I'm just hoping that they're, you know, they're filming. They don't film too late. Because that's another thing that would bother all these. You know, don't underutilize him. Like, don't let him sit there. For, I mean, like, he's not sitting there. He's doing other stuff. But mm -hmm. let's get him filming a whole bunch of stuff in Series 11 for the following year. Mm -hmm. but they have to film next year. They can't, like, you know, that's the whole point. They film next year for the following year. So, yeah, that's my concern. So, and I think too, I, I made an announcement the other cast. I said I really feel that Paul is going to like this style, which him know is going to stay on for another series, like series yeah. twelve. But I predicted that, but we'll see what happens. Actually, um, are you guys excited about the direction Doctor Who's headed? I mean, are you excited with Moffat's final season? Yeah, yeah, yeah. I'm finally happy that Moffat's off and. If you get somebody else to be a showrunner, and we get this, hopefully this lose loose ends, leave loose ends uh, type of setup, uh, opening up in one episode, and then it, then you close it off maybe 
in an unrelated adventure further down the line. Yeah. But still, this is leaving everything open ended, or or even like maybe a season afterwards. Yeah, uh, close the close the loop. I agree with you, Scott. I think they should make it to where it's like fresh and like where Chibnall can just start anew, and and where there's nothing that will be like making it like. Because I'm the type of person I would kind of, kind of feel let down if there's too much left, you know, that we don't know and and everything. It would kind of mess with my mind and it would stick there and it would what and leave me alone and I want to be able to enjoy the next. <laughs> one. So. <laughs> but I started thinking for a moment because I watched uh, a little bit because I watched uh, uh, Parting of the Ways again about a few days ago and started me thinking, you know. With Rose stating that she can see the past and the future, it'd be kind of unique if they set it up to where Rose somehow during her uh, during her time of being taken over by the time yeah. vortex, switch change it, mucks things up. You don't realize it, but she manages to change things, which uh, where it returns back to where it originally was instead of. Clara always being the one who helped the doctor here, here, and here. Yeah. What about you, Glory? <laughs> that made me laugh, guys. <laughs> I'm, I'm glad my face makes somebody laugh. Oh, no, it wasn't was your face. It was what came out of your face that made me laugh. <laughs> <laughs> oh! Okay. <laughs> Welcome to the 17 portion of the show, ladies and gents. <laughs> so, showrunner Gloria, what would you do? Oh man, don't even get me started. <laughs> <laughs> I don't even know where I would begin, man. There's so much, <laughs> and I don't want to get like in a drawn out like. <laughs> I know. But, you know, pretty soon we're going to be talking, you know, we're going to be talking about Doctor Who this week, but when it comes to next weekend, you know, we're going to be yeah. talking about next week. <laughs> yeah! <laughs> Finally, we're going to, you know, I'm, we're just, you know, we talk about other, we do other podcasts here yeah. at Matrix Lord 2 and 2 Inc., <laughs> but um, <laughs> we're, we're going to be talking about Walking Dead totally next next week. ML 12 Inc., yeah. It's going to be a doozy. Yeah. But uh, we've got, we got Walking Dead, we got yeah. Class. And all right. That. We'll be talking Class on here, too. I, the class is next week. Yeah. Um. So we're going to try to watch it. Go to look up the site called Streamlord. That way. Cause no Joe's relation not, to me, by the way. So just you know. Yeah, yeah. No relation to Joe here. No. But no, it, I, I have noticed it's it's updated about an hour, hour, hour and a half after the show ends. So. Okay. I never heard of that thing, but well, you've said it before. But you know, I do want to see class. We'll see. Um, and again, Capaldi is appearing in the first episode, so that's pretty cool. And I like the trailers. Um, the full trailer, not the you know, teaser trailer. Cause I was like, Oh, it's the doctor talking and I would rather promote class than the doctor. You know, it's like, we don't need to promote the doctor. So it's like, he's got his own thing, you know? Mm -hmm. So, uh, I think, you know, from the looks of it, I would just expect it to be a hit. Cause it looks really well done. Yeah. And I expect it to have a season two, but I'm just guessing. I, again, I haven't seen it. So I just, it looks wonderful. You know, I'm giving yeah, more minutes, the benefit of the doubt, but we'll see. Yeah, I think yeah. They, starting off with eight episodes so people can get used to it is good, and then maybe next go to ten or something like yeah. Everything. Yeah, the next season add two more. Ten and or fourteen or whatever, or whatever thirteen each time, or just keep it at ten or eleven. But yeah. still, all right. So that's it for the Real Hoobians cast. We do have to talk about other things, so we'll be doing our everything show soon. So thank you, Gloria. Thank you, Scott. Take care, bye for now.